Hello guys, welcome back to Revit 2016 video tutorials. In this video tutorial, we'll go through the staircases. So, uh, you can see, this is our 3D model and I have already drawn a staircase. So, I will show you how to do the staircases. Let us, uh, let me go to, let's say, third floor level. And let me close this level, which is sixth floor. Now coming over here, so staircase is pretty simple. I mean, they can be very easy to model. So you go over architecture and select your stair. Then in edit type, I mean you can have your properties like maximum riser height. You can edit that and it depth you can edit that to your convenience to your calculations okay and that is pretty much everything so coming to the uh, drawing you can uh, select either one of these but since you have it like rectangle or so circular and this center and spiral goes out of the question so let's select this and what I will do is I'll, let's say I will have a stair for a distance of 11 feet so that will be like uh, going from bottom to the up and then I have uh, the lobby area in between and the other stair that is going up to the end so this will be the like uh, lobby area so that you can walk from over here to the other side I mean you can edit this since this is the whole po uh, the box whole portion you can just uh, move it to the end wherever you feel comfortable so this should be sufficient for walking and now if you can see over here let us see in our diagram so that's pretty much it and you select this right right symbol that creates your staircase for for the floor between uh, so let us select that staircase and let us know it's between uh, base level is at third floor and top level is at fourth floor so what we can do is we can have the base level at uh, let's say parking and top level at the end of ninth floor and Looks like dif due to different heights we have some problems. Uh, let us uh, let us just have it. Uh, I mean, in between third floor, uh, third and fourth floor. Select apply. That's it. So uh, you can have it. You had it between third and fourth floor, and these god rails were the rails that were done in the last video. And you can just what I can do is I can just edit those rails. Uh, I can give a different name select rail 2 ok and I can say edit ball star placement will be like a square ball and let us say this would be at 3 feet distance select ok then select edit for rail structure uh, let us remove that one and uh, that one and the remaining stays same select apply select ok now select ok so that changes your uh, rail so if you look at that that looks good 
I mean the staircase can be simple in drawing and modeling so I was unable to do for the entire all the floors because uh, at some of the floors looks like the, the height is different which changes the uh, threads and razors calculations different let us uh, let us let us do it from so since if this is the ninth floor level this will be eight seven six fifth fourth third second first and this will be ground floor level this will be parking and this will be basement so let's say uh, I have from ground Alright, sorry about that. There are guests, guests at my door. Anyhow, so you can do your staircases in this way. Uh, let me try ground level. Oh, we have over here the hole. Let me have a staircase run from this end to 11 feet from there till there and I can just uh, extend this to the end of the hole then I can select the I mean I can make it till let's say third floor level select apply then I will select right over here so at some of this it looks like the staircase stop and exits so let us make it uh, I'm sorry back to normal let us go to the first floor that will be better and if you view it in your 3d you can see over there there you have your staircase you can edit your rails just like I did in the previous one I mean I can just select rail type 2 that's it in that way you can do your rails and sometimes uh, the staircases can be like uh, hidden so if you see over here uh, if you select this this can be like hidden mode and everything in pink color confirms that they are hidden so sometimes if they are hidden you select that stair and just select unhide category over here so so that it it, it, it becomes unhide alright that looks good for the video so in this way uh, you can do your staircases part for your building so that's done almost so thank you for watching the video